Fluoride is a special mineral that's found in the earth and we add it to drinking water and dental products to help protect our teeth from getting cavities. And what you're looking at in the orange cup mm -hmm. is liquid fluoride. And this is an egg that we've had, um, it's been hard boiled and we've put it in the fluoride for about six hours. I dropped mm -hmm. it in this morning when I came in, okay? And this is a hard boiled egg that has been just on the tray for six hours. And these two cups are two cups of vinegar. Vinegar is acidic. When we have anything with sugar in it, it changes our saliva um, into a more acidic state, okay? Especially when we eat sugar. So the fluoride, we hope, will help to protect our teeth from cavities. So we have an experiment set up to do that, okay? Mm -hmm. So what I want you to do is to take your spoon and take the egg that's been in the fluoride out and drop it in one of the vinegar glasses. Try not to make it dry. Mm -hmm. Okay, good job. And then you can take the egg that's out of the fluoride and drop it in the other vinegar glass. Okay. This one's bubbling up. Mm-hmm. And that one's just like not really doing anything. Not doing anything, is it? Well, this one isn't bubbling up because this was in um, fluoride. The fluoride, and that one wasn't in anything, and then it it went in vinegar, and then it started bubbling. Mm-hmm. Let me tell you what's happening here, okay? When the egg is soaked in the vinegar, it's reacting with the shell. In the shell, this shell has not been protected with fluoride at all. So the bubbles that you see are the carbon dioxide bubbles, the same kind of bubbles that you see when you pour a, a soda, Oh yeah. how you mm -hmm. see the, the fizz. Mm -hmm. That's the carbon dioxide gas that's given off. Um, so the vinegar is reacting and causing the shell to break down. Vinegar contains an acid that's strong enough to dissolve the calcium carbonate, it's a big word, the calcium carbonate that's in the shell of the enamel. So if this is strong enough to dissolve the calcium carbonate on the egg, do you think that an acid would be strong enough to dissolve the calcium away from our teeth? Um, yes. Mm -hmm. And so the idea with the fluoride, if you look over here, this is real still and calm and quiet. Okay, and over here they're having a tooth party. It's bubbling, it's spinning. So it's breaking down the outer layer of the shell. And eventually, if your teeth weren't protected with fluoride, the acids would get into the teeth and break down and eventually cause cavities.